Well, look at this article. This is from China. This is just a free example. China's new lucrative business. Dead babies turn into stamina booster pills. This is just last week, August 5th. You said what? Dead babies? Yeah. They're, uh, they're grabbing all the aborted babies from China. They put them out in the sun. Los sacan al sol a los bebés. All right? They powder them down. I mean, they grind them. Right? They grind them. Los muelen. And then they put them directly in these capsules. Te lo ponen directo al bebé en la cápsula. And it gives you a better stamina, sex drive, everything. You see, you're participating in eating the sacrifice, the baby sacrifice, yes. It's the new thing. So these people from SBS in South Korea, they created a documentary where they're accusing Chinese pharmaceutical companies of selling dead baby pills as stamina boosters. They found fingernails, hair, heart tissue. They found everything inside these pills. This is happening right now. But if you go to alexanderbachman.com, you can get the facts. You can get a flyer. Visit childrenofgod.com. It's a huge organization in the United States that's doing a great campaign to stop these people. But the problem is not in China. The problem is here. Well, Anthony, you know, I'm pretty new to all this conspiracy stuff. So um, I'm just sharing my beliefs from my independent study over the last two years up until two years ago I would have never believed that any of this stuff exists I wouldn't have believed in the Illuminati or the Council on Foreign Relations or the Bilderbergs or or any of that other stuff it's it's so far-fetched it's so hard for people to believe that there are people out there who have little regard whatsoever for human life and feel that they're better than everybody else and, and this planet is theirs uh, for the taking. And uh, no, I, I never imagined this uh, at all. Just go and research the word Senomix, okay? Senomix is a transnational company that creates flavor enhancement for products for transnational companies like Pepsi, Kraft, Nestle, Campbell's. And what they've been doing is that they graft uh, kidney cells from human aborted fetuses. So they grab these kidney cell lines, las células sanguíneas del, de los riñones de bebés abortados, and in laboratory they replicate these cells and they put them in all your products. Lo ponen los productos. What products are we talking about? Well, we're talking about your Gatorade. Drink some aborted babies. Yes, seriously. We're talking about Lay's chips. Yeah, that's why they taste so good, don't they? Uh, Pepsi products, all right? Tropicana juices, Dasani water, Minute Maid. We have to not consume anything from these companies. And tell them that we're gonna participate in their insane rituals.